ब्रेकफास्ट फर्स्ट टर्म ऑलरेडी गिवन फर्स्ट टर्म मींस ए वैल्यू सेवेंथ टर्म सेवेंथ टर्म नथिंग बट ए सेवन व्हाट इज ए सेवन अम्मा ज्योमेट्रिक प्रोग्रेशन ए एन इज इक्वल टू ए आर पावर एन माइनस वन देन ए सेवन बिकम्स ए इनटू आर पावर सिक्स फाइन दिस वैल्यू ऑलरेडी दे हैव गिवन सिक्सटी फोर A seven they have given sixty four. What is A seven twenty nine into R to the power of six is equal to sixty four. From this, what is the common ratio? R power six is two by three. Two by three sir. Yeah, sixty four can be written as two power six by three power six. Three power six. Right, two power six means this can be written as two by three, all power six, which implies what is our value? Two by three. Here yeah, we got it. Uh, here A already given. We got E R value. Then we need to find what is the value we need to find? S seven. What is S seven formula? First S N. S N is equal to. Yeah. One minus R n by one minus one. One minus R power n or R power n minus one. One minus R power n. R is R is greater less than. Exactly by one minus R. Substitute in place of a. So now S seven in place of a seven twenty nine in place of R two by three in place of n seven because S seven means n value is seven. This you can do at home. Okay, let's sir, do the next one. Yeah, sir. At least next period you can give revision, sir. <laughs> you want revision, sir? Because four chapters, sir. You could see the chapters. I know that you got a lot of time. You know, last Sunday and uh, last we got one or two holidays. Yes or no? Okay, anyhow, I'll give no problem. Uh, you want to self-study? Sir, no, sir. You can give revision, sir. Next period. Revision. Sir, you can revise the important formulas alone, sir. Okay, ma. Surely. Sir, yesterday did we have a class at five o'clock, sir? Yesterday. Yes, I entered. I waited. I think I will wait five minutes. After that, we left the meeting. I also forgot to join, sir. Okay, no problem. No problem. We'll do the revision. Yeah, fine. Uh, next question, sixteenth one. Find a GP. We need to find the geometric progression for which. The sum of first two terms, okay. The sum of first two terms is minus four. Okay, we want to find the GP for that sum of first two terms. They given first two terms means shall I take S two? Sum of first S two only, no. Two terms S two nothing but a one plus a two. The sum for first two terms is S two sum of First n terms is S n like that. S two is equal to minus four. They given. Next, any other condition they have given? Fifth term is four times of third term. See, uh, this is sum. This is term. You have to take carefully. Fifth term. Fifth term can be taken by. Sir, a r power four is equal to. A five is equal to. First, we'll take like this. A five is equal to four times of a four times of a three. That's all. Okay. Since we know that uh, two formulas, what are the two formulas? S n S n formula is uh, a into r to the power of n minus one by r minus one, and a n a n is equal to a r to the power of n minus one. A into one. r power minus n minus one. Right with this, a uh, a 
फाइव ए फाइव मीन्स ए आर पावर यस ए आर पावर ए आर पावर फोर इज इक्वल टू फोर इंटू ए फोर इंटू ए आर स्क्वायर ओके शेल आई कैंसिल योर कैंसिल सर आर स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू फोर सो आर स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू फोर आर इज इक्वल टू प्लस एंड माइनस टू या ये वी गोट इट द कॉमन रेशो द कॉमन रेशो इज व्हाट द कॉमन रेशो इज क्लियरली प्लस एंड माइनस टू नथिंग बट ये वी गोट टू डिफरेंट केसेस two different cases and s2 s2 means what is s2 ma s2 is equal to 4 already they have given minus 4 what is s2 formula a into sir a sir 1 minus r power 2 r square divided by 1 minus 1 minus or 1 plus Sir, one we can take minus. Sir, we will take two both. Sir, then we will get two answers. Yes. Uh, R minus one. Either any one of the way you can take. No problem. So here yeah, the thing is, it is equal to minus four. Okay. From this strains. Uh, here a into R power n. S two. S two. Nothing but what is n value strain? n value is two, two. two r two. value is if I consider as two two square minus one by two, uh, minus. two minus one. Okay, we'll do one thing. We'll do in two different cases. Uh, right, case one. R is equal to plus two. Plus two is greater than one. Whenever greater than one, just now I have written formula. S n formula is Uh, a into r power n minus one by r minus one. So here s two value, s two value they have given minus four, minus four or plus four, minus four. Now in this case, a into uh, substitute r value here. R value is two to the power of two minus one by two minus one. This is equal to minus four. Now here. Uh, Simplify. What is a value? Four minus one, three by one is equal to minus four. So a value we got is minus four by three. Right, students? This is first value. Now in the same way, in case two, case two, I want to take your case two. In case two, r is minus two. Minus two is lesser than one. Whenever it is lesser than one, we know that S N formula is a into one minus r power n by one minus r. Okay, yes, two is clear. Like again, minus four they have given a into r one minus minus two whole power. Sir, coming to one, yes. Sorry. Is it right? Now, in this case, what is the a value you are going to get? Am I? Four, sir. Ah, uh, so uh, like uh, two square. Sir, it will be coming as minus three a by three is equal to minus four, sir. So a is equal to four. Sir. Okay, right. Okay, a value is four. Clear, students. So right now, a value is four. now they ask you what what is the question we need to find the geometric progression geometric mean at least you have to find three terms first term second term third term so what is the geometric progression formula ma? when uh, a is the first term you have to write like this uh, let a is a and A and cap smaller with the first term and common ratio of GP. Then, then what is GP? Am I? How to write that? GP A AR AR square AR cube so on. 
even here also a a r a r square so on minimum three terms you should write okay a value is minus 4 by 3 minus 4 by 3 comma minus 4 by 3 what is r value ma common ratio here in this first case 2 plus 2 2 minus 4 by 3 2 square so on here a a value is what 4 in this case it is 4 4 into 4 into r value r value is minus 2 4 into minus 2 square so on so what is the gp there are two different cases we have in that uh, the first geometric progression is minus 4 by 3 minus 8 by 3 minus uh, 16 by 3 so on minus 32 by 3 like that here 4 minus 8 plus 16 minus 32 so on here plus 30 minus 32 by 3 like that okay what well, these are the required gp required gp when second term is minus 4 and fifth term is four times of the third term having any doubts friends first clear clear i think it's a very clear next question a uh, fourth term 10th term 6th term and gp is xyz prove that xyz are in gp that you have to uh, do this y square is equal to you have to do the geometric means that the group needs both it will be equal if you can say xyz are in gp yes sir we can say they are in geometric means sir by ar cube and ar power 9 and ar power 15 yes R so here like x by y by x is equal to z by y. Sir. Like that only. Okay. Our common ratio is equal to x y z are in GP means. Uh, R is equal to like uh, we have to do like uh, y by x is equal to z by y. Nothing but otherwise you can uh, find like y squared separately, x z separately. Then if both will be equal, therefore we can say that x y z are in GP. That's all. It's a simple question that you have. I think you got a complete idea about this. We can try. But these kind of questions are important for board level. Not only board, even uh, OBT also. These kind of questions are important. What they asking here? Sum of n terms, n terms of this sequence. Eighteen. What is the sequence they have given? Eight common sir. Right. I think uh, you, uh, student. Uh, do you have any idea about this kind of questions? Eight. Yes, sir. Eight. 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 Other than nine, other nine than first you have to take eight common. Uh, then after multiplying, dividing with nine, like that will do. Absolutely right, sir. Only two steps here. Sum of n terms. Sum of n terms. Okay, right. So S n is equal to what shall we do? It is not a uh, nine in terms of not nine 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 not like that. It is. Eight other than nine. Whenever it is other than nine, like it may be uh, two, three till uh, other than nine. Okay, so till eight. So first, I want to take eight common. Whenever if I take eight common, one. One plus eleven plus hundred and eleven plus thousand hundred and eleven. Then after. Multiply and dividing with multiply and divide by nine, sir. That's all. Whenever multiply dividing nine plus ninety nine nine plus triple nine. 
this is the processor you have to remember test 10 minus 1 100 minus 1000 minus 1 right exactly so first step is take common if it is 8 is i'm taking 8 common if it is 7 plus 77 plus 77 7 take common if it is 6 plus 66 means take 6 common next step second step is multiply and dividing with 9 this is the second step so after this 9 can be written as 10 minus 1 plus 100 minus 1000 exactly up to n terms you have to write in the bracket up to n terms in each line okay now students sn is equal to 8 by 9 then after see at 10 plus i need to write 10 100 1000 10000 everything at 1 plus uh, 100 plus 1000 plus 1 at 1 plus remaining values minus 1 yeah, into n minus n sir yes that will become directly n minus 1 minus 1 minus 1 so minus 1 will be repeated n times so 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus up to n times okay so 8 by 9 10 10 square 10 cube plus 1 okay plus uh, not plus minus 1 is repeated n times so n into 1 okay students what about this one there a equal to 10 and d equal yeah. r equal to 10 clearly it is in gp here let a is equal to 10 the common ratio is given by 100 by 10 square by 10 that is equal to 10 10 is greater than 1 see here common ratio is greater than 1 how many times are there n it is sn so now sn is equal to 8 by 9 into right students so what is the uh, sn formula here Sir, a into into r power minus 1 by r minus 1 yeah a into right i, I want to uh, 10 power n minus 1 divided by 9 into r power n minus 1 by r minus 1 uh, with the help of this i want to write 10 10 power n minus 1 by 10 minus 1 minus n so s n is equal to 8 by 9 okay 10 10 power n minus 1 by 9 minus n this is the answer even you may multiply also you can multiply with 8 sir, by 9 we will get 8 into 10 power n minus 9 n by 81 sir 10 power n minus 10 uh, okay or we can take minus is it clear? Okay, what is the answer they have given in book back that I want to know? Is it right? So they have given us 80 by 81 into 10 power n minus oh, 1 minus 8 they, they do not multiply it with uh, uh, 10 they multiply 8 into 10 80 tell me once sn is equal to what they have given 80 by 81. 9 minus okay into 10 power n minus 1 minus 8 by 9 okay fine fine But we can write in uh, another way also. No, sir. I mean, many ways, this both will be right only. But you know, in exam, sometimes we don't know where we where we can stop. Am I right? So you may put any one of the answers. This is our answer. You may stop here, you may stop here also, that is also right. But we don't know, no, all are correct only. 
So what I have done here, I'm taking eight common. I multiply dividing with nine. That uh, nine can be written as ten minus one. Ninety-nine can be written as hundred minus one. Nine triple nine can be written as thousand minus one. So on till n terms. So like that, ten, hundred, thousand. It write at one place. So remaining minus one, minus one, minus one. Write at other place. So finally, we got right like this. Is it clear, students? Right. That is the answer. Yeah. Uh, what about the question number nineteen? Find the sum of the product corresponding terms of the sequence two, four, eight, and oh. Sum of product of the corresponding terms of the sequence. So what shall we do, dear yes, students? You want to tell me? So we should add two into one twenty eight plus four uh, into thirty two plus eight into eight plus like that. Two, two into. Yeah. Obviously. Sir, these are two different sequences, or we should calculate two together, sir. Two different sequences. We should calculate together, or we should find sum and product in each sequence, sir. No, no, no. Together. They are asking you know together sum of the product of corresponding terms of the sequences. So what is the first term here? Two. What is the first term here? Sixteen. Sorry, one twenty-eight. They given two different sequences. Am I right? Now, uh, it, otherwise you can tell me what are the different sequences here. Sir, in first case R is equal to two, sir, and in second case R is equal to one by four. Might be. Sir, first sequence two, four, eight. Yeah, here two, four, eight. Or eight, eight. sixteen, thirty-two, sir. Yes. Second oh. sequence is one twenty eight, thirty two, eight, two, one by two. Okay. So one by two. Sum of the product of corresponding terms. Sir, at last you need to write. Sir, you need to write one by two. Sir, you wrote twelve. Oh, one by two, na? No? Okay, okay. Good. Yeah, this is how to multiply. When you multiply here, two into one twenty eight, comma four into thirty two, comma sixteen into eight, comma sorry eighty two eight ah sixteen into two thirty two into one by two. So what about this two into one twenty eight? Two fifty-six. Come on. One twenty-eight. One twenty-eight. Sixty-four. Thirty-two. Sixteen. Nothing but sixteen table they have given. <coughs> sixteen. Oh, thirty-two. Like not sixteen table. Five. Sir, so, R is uh, equal to two. Sir, one by two. Right. E one. E two. E three. So on. So what is the common ratio? Right, one by two by right. Take any one of the values. So R is equal to two fifty six. Sorry, one twenty eight by two fifty six should be equal to one by two. What is the question? Question: Find the sum of the product of the sequence. Oh, some they are asking. No, oh, right? They are asking. Okay, here we got the first term is two fifty six. Common ratio is one by two. They are asking some S n. How many terms are there? One, two, three, four, five. Nothing but S five. So two fifty six. So we may calculate it directly also. So we we can easily find the sum directly. But uh, in NCERT you should not do like this. So what is the formula here? R is clearly lesser than one. What is the same formula? A into one minus R power n by one minus R. We know that A value. We know that R value. We know that n value. S five. Only five terms are there. Ah, uh, two fifty six. 
1 minus 1 by 2 whole power 5 by 1 minus 1 by 2. This two becomes what is thirty two, no sir. Yeah, thirty two. You can take LCM, and two into this two fifty six becomes what? Students, five twelve. Sir, we can calculate in a different way, sir. Sir, five twelve into thirty one by thirty two, sir. Yes. So answer four ninety six, sir. The five five twelve and thirty two will get cancelled, sir. Thirty-two, thirty-two times of yes. For sixteen, sir. Five hundred divided by thirty-two. Oh, okay. Sixteen. 16. 16. Uh, so what about this? Sixteen into thirty-one. The four ninety-six. Okay, five. So this is the required answer. Sir, you so need to find the product also, sir. Product also, you multiply with 256. So here, see here, they given two sequences. They're asking the sum of the product of the corresponding elements, terms. So that first I multiplied the corresponding terms. We got one sequence. I adding, uh, so uh, we found the common ratio also. It is lesser than one. Some they are asking for that adding all the values. There are total five terms are there. S5. S5 we need to find. S5 value is 496. That's all. Okay. Show that the product of corresponding term of are in GP. Find the common ratio. That's this question I'm giving to you. When you multiply here, A, A square, A square, so on. A R power n means A into uh, R power n minus 1, capital R power n minus 1. Like that, you will get. Okay, students? This you have to try. Okay? You can do this question easily. If you feel difficult, I'll explain. Let us go for the next questions. Find four numbers forming a geometric progression in which the third term is greater than the first term by nine. Greater than first term by nine means how can we write term? Term nothing but a. How to write that condition, among students? Well, we can a? take a by three r, a by r, a r, and a three r, sir. Is it the mention in the product? No, sir. I'm asking, can we take, sir? We can take, we can take, but uh, that is quite uh, uh, like it will take more steps, more number of steps. If they mention product at that time alone, you can take A by R, A, A, R. Otherwise, A, A, R, A, R square, like A, R cube, like that, you have to take. So, here, the third term, what is the condition they given? Third term is greater than nine of the first term. How can we write that condition? Uh, a plus 9, very good. So A1 plus 9 or A plus 9, right only. Next. Sir, AR cube equal to AR plus 18. Greater than. So A2 is, is equal to A4 plus 18. Am I right? A3 is equal to A plus 9. A2 is equal to A4 plus 18. Then, what are the four numbers like A1, A2, A3, A4? That's it. They ask you, what are the four numbers? Those four numbers satisfy these two conditions. Third term is 9 greater than the first term. Okay. By 9, second term is greater than fourth term by 18. So do it and tell me first yourself. 
so these questions not at all difficult question very easy question strings i think so you are doing also very nice so i am taking four terms are a a1 a2 a3 a4 a3 is equal to a1 plus 9 nothing but a r square is equal to a plus 9 okay this is one another question is another condition is a2 is equal to a4 plus 18 ar for a second term is ar is equal to ar cube plus 18 students is it clear sir can we have q is equal to ar plus 18 Yes, students. Yes. Yeah. Sir, can we take a square is equal to a plus nine by a, sir? Your wish. Whatever the way you can do, you can find the common ratio. Solving these two equations, then tell me what is a and what is r. First. Yeah, multiply with a uh, year. As you said, you know, uh, multiply with R on both sides. A R square value is a plus nine. R is equal to minus two, sir. R is equal to. Minus two, sir. A equal to okay. B. Is it correct, students? Yes. 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 Yes
ओके स्टूडेंट्स योर आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू वन थिंग व्हेन फॉर एग्जांपल व्हाट आर द फोर टर्म्स जनरली ए ए आर ए आर स्क्वायर ए आर क्यूब एम आर स्टूडेंट्स सो व्हेन आई टेक योर प्लस आर माइनस वन ईयर प्लस आर माइनस वन ईयर वी वी गट थ्री डिफरेंट वैल्यूज थ्री डिफरेंट आर वैल्यूज कॉमन रेशियो वैल्यूज नो सो व्हेन आई टेक R value was plus one or minus one. Okay, when I take R is equal to plus one. What about the given series? Am I? Given sequence, a comma a comma a comma a. Am I right, students? When I take R is equal to one. But is it satisfied that uh, uh, second term is eighteen greater than the fourth term? When I take no, R sir. is equal to one. So is R is equal to one is the correct common ratio? Is it right? No. When I take r is equal to minus one, what is the uh, series sum? What is the given sequence? A minus A plus A minus A. So is there the second term is eighteen uh, times uh, greater than the fourth term? Is there third term is nine times greater than the first term? Is it right? So that is the common ratio which should not consider. We can't consider r is equal to plus or minus one. So r is equal to minus two alone. It is correct. This minus two you have to substitute here. So here the four terms are a, a r, a r square, a r cube. What is the a value, ma? Sir, a equal to three. Okay, sorry, sir. So when r is equal to minus two, r is equal to minus two, you have to find a value. A value to find A value, you can substitute over there. So what is A value? You got it, Amma? Sir, minus three, three, sir. Three. Okay, fine. Substitute here. Three, three into minus two, three into minus two square, three into minus two whole cube. So three minus six is twelve minus twenty-four. Ah, twenty-four. Is it clear, students? This is the required. This. Okay, students. Uh, you can. Any doubts? Some here. Awesome.